So what happens if you join Papa.c as a new player? Well, you're going to start here, but you're not going to see this very long. In fact, you're probably not even going to see this at all. Instead, you'll be teleported randomly anywhere across the whole entire map, which is 30 million blocks. Then, after you're teleported, the time will be set today. The weather will be set um, to sun. And then a bonus chest will spawn. This is pretty much exactly like if you start a single player world. And the bonus chest is also exactly like single player. With random contents from the official uh, vanilla single player loot. So it'll be completely random what you get. And this is entirely done by Majane. And then you're left to explore. So let's see where we are. Um, we ended up in coordinates negative 16,577,032. Uh, uh, um, and then we ended up um, at coordinate Z at negative 17,951. Uh, and the words were, were pretty far out. <laughs> um, now, there's more to the server that you can explore. It's, of course, just a plain vanilla server. Um, it does have some plugins to kind of enhance the multiplayer experience. Uh, a lot of these are going to be walled off until you have ranked up to iron rank. Um, to rank up, uh, basically, it just proves that a lot of new players are pretty malicious um, and they're mean my server harm. So the rank up system is really kind of to see, um, you know, how, how much you actually want to play on the server and how much you're here just to, you know, be goof off and be potentially malicious. Um, so you start off at coal rank, uh, meaning you really don't have access to a lot of commands. But as you, um, to rank up, you just play the game. Um, so to rank up to iron rank, you need to play for about an hour. You need to, um, like craft a tool, to, uh, sleep in a bed. Um, you know, you need to uh, plant a seed and, you know, after you do those basic things, then you can go ahead and, um, rank up. Um, and then once you reach iron rank, um, you know, by doing those simple things and playing for an hour, then that's when you can really unlock um, quite a number of the features. Um, but you get access to different things like um, there's there's some warps. It's not a lot of warps because, you know, I want you to kind of explore and find your own um, biomes and stuff. So I don't really provide a lot of warps on the server, but, you know, there are some more. There's just uh, there's just different things you can do. But you really um, unlock all the extra stuff once you reach um, Iron Rank. And of course, there's other ranks above it that you can access uh, just by playing the game, just by doing different things. Um, a lot of the ranks above Iron, you have to put a lot more time into. Um, and there's a certain list of um, stuff like uh, uh, advancements and stuff that you need to get before overall uh this is you know it's just what makes mass server unique is just the fact that it's like um it's like single player so basically you spawn in the middle of nowhere just like single player um and you just kind of, um, you're just kind of on your own. You can just kind of build, uh, there's not really a spawn on my server. There's no spawn. It's just, you just kind of start in the middle of nowhere, usually with no one around you. Very rarely, um, I mean, 
the odds of you landing next to somebody is pretty rare, but I mean, I guess it's, it's possible. Um, but yeah, you just kind of do your own thing. Um, there are a lot of, there are several players on here. They'll be more than happy to help you. The, um, it's just a really nice and friendly community. The great thing about my server is because you start kind of in your own area, you don't have to worry about players building on top of each other and stuff. You know, you just, um, it's just, you could walk a, a, a several thousand blocks and you probably still would not come across an, another player. Um, and that's what's really nice and cool about my servers. My server is just a very uh, quiet server. It's for serious players. Um, players who want to play uh, Minecraft, just survival Minecraft. There are no mini games. There's no creative mode, nothing. It's just the game that you paid for it. But it does have a few plugins like this one that spawns you in the middle of nowhere and one that clears out the weather and sets the time today. Um, and that's just to make it more enjoyable so you don't spawn in the middle of the night or with a lot of monsters around or you don't spawn right at World Center where everyone else spawns. So now no one spawns at World Center and everyone kind of starts off very much like a single player world. And I think that's really cool. Um, there's some other plugins I have, like, um, that kind of randomizes the weather, which is really nice, too. And, um, it just makes it, things more interesting, you know, but nothing really interferes with, um, the vanilla game. So, my server is all about making vanilla better without losing sight of vanilla. Um, because vanilla is the most important thing on this server. Um, so I don't want to break anything that would uh, break vanilla. But yeah, uh, I can see the sun is setting. So. Yeah, that's really all in this episode. Thank you for watching and bye.